Libya's former oil minister has been found dead in Vienna's Danube River. Shokri Ghanem was head of the state-run National Oil Corporation under Colonel Gaddafi, but defected in June to support the rebel uprising. Lara Satrakian joins us in Dubai with the story. And Lara, what do we know so far? Well, Mark Ghanem was found with no major injuries, no clear cause of death, and autopsy is now underway. Ghanem was a kind of elder statesman within the OPEC circle with an extensive CV built up largely on the 40-decade rule of Muammar Gaddafi. He was the former head of OPEC, also the former oil chief for Libya, the former minister of economy, the one-time de facto prime minister. He did defect months into the revolution, later than many Gaddafi-era officials, but he was known, Mark, as a man who was trying to reform the system from within. Mark? And Laura, how has Libya's oil industry recovered since the end of the war? Well, fairly well. This month, they're up to 1.35 million barrels per day. That's just shy of the 1.6 million barrels per day before the war. And what we heard just after the war from security officials on the ground that proved to be true, that the war didn't leave much physical damage to Libya's oil sector. The rest of the country, however, has been uh, harder to control, harder to stabilize. Rival factions, rival militias on the ground feuding fighting, uh, also political turmoil in the transition to democracy, and foreign oil firms on the back foot worried that this new government might make good on its threats to review, uh, even redo, some of the contracts signed with the Gaddafi regime. For now, any for one is back to work in Libya. They are the largest foreign firm in the country. Their profits getting a boost as Libya's oil output recovers. Mark? Lara, thanks.